How to create a digital planner to sell on Etsy step by step. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and for today's video, I will show you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how you can easily create your digital planner for free and sell it on Etsy. So I like to use Canva because it's very user-friendly and you can also easily make use of their drag and drop tools and also you can upload different kind of images or icon to use in your designs and also uh, this platform is for free so this is the canva i already log into my account so i have some few designs here that i created and here to start with you can create a design here you can search for a specific layout here like for example for the instagram post for your instagram stories or any social media platform or you can also customize your own design by clicking on customize size and you can enter the width and the height of your designs layout or search it here so for example we will be searching for a planner since we will be creating a digital planner so here you have different suggestion here for a planner layout so as you can see here you have different design here that you can make use of so these are the templates that you may able to use to start with your design but for today's video we will be starting from scratch so let's go ahead and select the blank planner here so here we will be redirected to our blank canva so it's still loading so let's just wait for a while so here's our blank canva now so we have the a4 and with that we will start designing our digital planner and we will start with the background color so i believe most of the buyer from etsy are female so i will go ahead and try to choose a color that is feminine and also minimalist so let's make use of the color like pink one so let's go ahead and look for the pink so for example something like this and with that i will go ahead and insert my text here so you can have a header, subheading, and also your body text. So let's go ahead and make use of the heading or the header. So let's name it as Weekly Planner. All right, and here we have our font style. By the way, you can also make use of the font style here. These are the font combination that you may able to make use as well but let me go ahead and select some font style here all right so let me make use of this one for example and i don't want the block color so let's go ahead and look for like dark blue okay this one so I will go ahead and drag it here and then the next thing that I will be doing is I will be adding some elements so just search on elements here I will go ahead and search for flower elements and then just click enter and here you can search for photos graphics videos and audio so let me go ahead and select the graphics for us to see all the graphic designs so let me just choose this one for example and here you can also change the color of this design but i will just keep it as black and then i will move it here then i can adjust the transparency of this element so let's go ahead and lower the transparency so something like that i'm not really sure with the position but let me try to flip it Let's add another elements in the other side. So something like that. And also let's lower the transparency. All right, and after that, let me go ahead and look for the shape. So I will go ahead and search for shapes here. So here's the shape. 
So I will go ahead and add it here. Let me just change the size. And let me send this one back. And let's change the color to white. So something like that. And then let's add some shape here again. Let's search for a square. Okay, I like this one. And let's add it here. And I will just copy it and paste. So control C and then control V. And again, control C and control V. And then let me, I can let me just lock this so that it will not be moving anywhere. So let me just select this and change this size. All right, and I will go ahead and copy this three and move it down here. All right, so we can now insert the text here for Monday. So give me a moment. All right, so I will go ahead and type Monday. Let's make it bold. So I just skip the video. And now here's the design so far. So we have now the Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And now I will go ahead and add some information here. Let me go ahead and go to text and let's add some text here. Like for example, weekly goal. All right, and let's make it bold. And then let me just move it here and then resize it. All right, and then after that, I will go ahead and add some lines. So you just need to search for lines here. And I will be using this one here. I like this one. And then we can just copy and paste this one and move it here. And another one. All right, and then here you can also add some motivational uh, quotes if you like to. Or you can also add more design here, like some elements. So just look for any design here inside the Elements tab. And once you're ready to download your design, then go ahead and click Share. And go to Download. And you have a different file type here, so you can download it as PNG or PDF standard. Let me go ahead and select the PDF standard and then just click download. And once you downloaded your design in your PC, then go ahead and go to Etsy. And then you can start adding this uh, digital planner design here inside your Etsy and sell it here. So that's how easy you can create your own digital planner or any graphic design for free on Canva and sell it here on Etsy. So I hope that you learned something from this video. And if you have any question, just comment down below. And thank you so much for watching.